Hey folks, I am Kevin Ioli. Welcome to Yahoo Sports. My uh, guest right now is Logan Paul on Sunday in Miami. He is fighting Floyd Mayweather Jr. And I saw Logan quotes that you're saying you can knock out Floyd Mayweather Jr. You can beat Floyd Mayweather Jr. That's quite a statement given uh, he calls himself the best ever. Kevin, anyone could knock out Floyd Mayweather Jr. You could knock out Floyd Mayweather Jr. My mother could do it. You know why? Because everyone's human. And everyone can get knocked out. And there comes a time in a man's life when he needs to know when to hold him and when to fold him. And I think Floyd may have crossed that line. Is it is it size that makes you believe that way? I mean, uh, Floyd 50-0, you're 0-1. I mean, there, you know, there, it seems like is size your advantage in this fight? Yeah, I mean, you know, statistics are with me and are also not with me. I totally hear what you're saying. Yeah, obviously my size is uh, – is an advantage of mine, my youth, my want, uh, my desire to be the greatest ever. Uh, Floyd did it, you know, but it's over. Champ, sorry, got your hat. <laughs> yeah, your brother, your brother Jake uh, stole, stole his hat. So Jake has made a number of mistakes in the past. Is this the biggest one he's made, getting Floyd a little angry and maybe bringing him more into the fight? He, he won't be sleeping on you now, I would think. No, no, I mean, look, Floyd wants to kick my ass. Like, I get it, but, I, you know, I want to kick his ass too. So, so, what, so now what? Right. What happens if, uh, if Floyd hits you with, uh, with a shot? Because, you know, I, I can imagine that you haven't been hit by somebody as quick and as accurate a puncher as he is. And a lot of times they say, uh, Logan, the punches that hurt you the most are the ones you don't see. Uh, what do you do if you get hit by Floyd? Take it and move on. It's boxing, you know. We're going to get hit. That's, that's what we do. Like, the name of the game is uh, to hit and not get hit, but it happens. So, yeah, Floyd's going to tag me for sure. And I imagine it's going to be qu uh, quick. I imagine he's going to be strong, but it's the name of the game, bro. Like, this is the shit we prepare for. We'll be ready for anything. What, what do you do? I mean, uh, I give you a lot of credit because, you know, you made a career out of, you know, you're making a ton of money uh, doing this, right? And your brother doing the same thing. you got all these fighters that are talking your names. Uh, when, when combined, you have, what, four fights, right? So I give you a ton of credit for that. But I wonder, like, you know, do you feel like you're disrespecting the sport of boxing when, when most of the time the commissions wouldn't approve a guy who's 0-1 against somebody who's 50-0? Uh, do you feel that's disrespecting the sport and it's hurting other fighters? Or do you feel like you're lifting the sport by doing this? None of this is my fault. You know, this opportunity was presented with me uh, to me and I took it because I like taking on challenges. And, and here we are like, uh, you know, don't get mad at me. I'm putting as much respect on the sport as I possibly can. Like we work our asses off, man. We work harder than most uh, legitimate fighters, which we are now, you know, and I know it's so hard for people to wrap their, their head around the fact that, you know, we may have made a little bit of a career shift, but the staple behind everything we've done in life, Jake and I, has been our work ethic, and it's no different in boxing. No, God bless you. I love it. I love what you're doing. The, the only thing I don't like is the fact that you're fighting, you know, like, like in other words, as I said, the commission would not approve this fight had it been, you know, uh, if you were everything the same, but you weren't a YouTube sensation, but because the money is there, that's why this fight is being approved. And I guess that's my only concern. Why not start at the bottom and work your way up as opposed to, in your second pro fight fighting the greatest of all time? Because we started at the bottom. Now we're here. There you go. All right. Well, I know it's uh, you're really busy. I appreciate your time, brother. On uh, June 6th, you can buy the uh, Showtime pay-per-view, Logan Paul versus Floyd Mayweather. Logan, all the best to you, my man. Thank you. Thank you, Kevin. See ya.